Crime in Denver and most other areas around Denver has risen over the past couple of years. There's one town that's actually seen crime drop. Take Denver, for example. Overall crime rose 7% from 2021 to 2022. In that time, Aurora saw an 8% increase. Castle Rock seems to be the outlier. Nine News crime and justice reporter Matt Jablo explains what's behind the trend. It was a quiet morning in the town of Castle Rock much like it was for most of last year. We're very fortunate. And just the way that police chief Jack Cauley likes it. Absolutely. While most of the metro area saw significant increases in crime last year, Castle Rock saw the opposite. Overall crime decreased 39 percent between 2021 and 2022. 166 total crimes in 2021 compared to 113 last year. It really takes the people, the technology, and the community uh, working together to see the results that we're seeing. Chief Cauley says the decline in crime can be attributed to several factors. Among them, the fact that unlike most metro area police departments, Castle Rock is fully staffed. Even in today's challenging times for recruiting police officers and retaining them, we were able to, to do just that. Chief Cauley says technology has also played a major role in his department's recent success, specifically about 40 electronic license plate readers, or LPRs, scattered throughout town to help find vehicles connected to crimes. Half of the LPRs are owned by the police department, the other half by various homeowners associations, but information from all the LPRs goes back to police. So if a HOA has a license plate reader in their neighborhood and a stolen vehicle passes through that, then we will, we will be notified as, with that as well. It's another example of uh, working closely with our community. I think for us, it's, it's been uh, very effective. Chief Cauley says he expects the decline in crime to continue this year, though he acknowledges that equaling last year's 39% drop will be difficult. Alex? All right, Matt Jablow, thank you.